G'day viewers, just a short video today, got to start by telling you today it was uh, cool and overcast, a nice breeze blowing through town, uh, I don't think the temperature got over 29 degrees today, so it made for uh, quite a cold day of salt crowning. Thanks mate. So if you listen carefully in the background, you might hear me squealing like a little girl. That's the sound of my balls shriveling up in the tiny little peas as the freezing cold water <laughs> changes my anatomy. Yeah, I think only the die-hard song craners in Patio were out today and uh, the numbers were up on yesterday. Even though uh, conditions weren't perfect and the sun wasn't out to warm us up and uh, get us in the mood. I think everybody realizes that the Song Kran crazy train has only got two more days before it hits the station on the 19th. So uh, we're going to have to make the most of it. Only two days left. Three if you count today. And today's the 17th of April 2017. And this is my record of what was happening today in Pattaya for Song Kran 2017. Well, here we are, mate. It's the last day. Come on! <laughs> yeah, I've got my mad mate with me again, keeping me company as we ride around all the best places to Song Crown and Patio today. And here we are on Beach Road, just about to go into Soy 8. See what's going on in there. Some more shots along Beach Road uh, between Soy 8 and Soy 9. They took the barricades down today. I don't know what happened with the coppers. They usually put them up and uh, just keep the people away from the traffic. But they took them down today for some reason. Maybe they thought there wasn't enough people. I'm not sure, but uh, yeah. Yeah, people were moving in and out between the traffic planes on front. Gets a bit risky, but that's how they want it. There's a lot of uh, stage building and sound checks going on today on the public area, on the footpath there. So uh, there's going to be a lot of celebrating, a lot of, a lot of big music playing. And uh, also I noticed just up further here, 
they're uh, building the second set of um, uh, water sprays but uh, overhead water sprays here they are here so there would be another cool down area where people would be able to come and walk under and under the water and uh, cool down during the hot day on the 90. So here we are again back in soy 6, the fun soy. <laughs> uh, yeah, it was a bit of a toss up today between soy 6 and soy 7. Uh, so I'm, I'm going to give it to soy 7 today as the best place to sun crown. Seem to be going on a fair bit more there than in soy 6. Soy 6 was great today, but uh, yeah, I'm just going to give it to soy 7. It was something about what was going on down there this afternoon that was just uh, a bit better than Soy 6. Check this out, this guy's about to get cream big time. <laughs> Just hammering this poor bastard. <laughs> it's funny how when, when somebody steps out of line, they all sense it and they all just hammer one particular person. They just don't let up on them <laughs> till they end up running away. <laughs> oh, it's a lot of fun. Everybody's got their own style of sun crowning. Some love the hit and run approach. <laughs> Some like the you know, stay put and wait for someone in victim. Look at this girl, she's got a she's got a garbage bin as a shield. She's gonna go a long way. <laughs> The thing I like about Soy 6 is they got the bar wars, you know. You got one bar on the other side of the street and they're just hammering the bar across the other side, just flows back and forth, people charging across the street. <laughs> and then uh, yeah, they, uh, they try to repel them and then the, the opposite bar runs across and tries to take revenge on them, you know. It's uh, quite comical. And the whole thing repeats all day long. <laughs> I don't know, they, they never run out of energy. They're just having a blast, having a good time. Just beating this strategy again and again and again. So we left Soy 6 and headed back down to Soy 8 again. Take a look, see what was going on down there. See if uh, the action had picked up. The level of energy was starting to rise see if it was different from the first time we went down. So here we are halfway up Soy 8 and uh, we're coming up to Rolling Live 4 or 5, I'm not sure which one it is. Uh, it's a live rock band uh, venue. Uh, so any of you guys that are um, interested in partying, 
the old fashioned way, grew up and roll in the 70s and 80s and 90s. This is the place to come right here, rolling live. They, uh, they sure know how to make a guitar piss. And you can sit down here uh, during weeknights on the weekends and uh, listen to your old favourite uh, classic covers from your favourite rock bands from the uh, from the 80s. So here we are in Soy 7, heading down Soy 7 towards Beach Road. Uh, we were here earlier but um, for some reason I, uh, I lost the footage, the camera stopped recording and I, I lost all the footage from the first trip down here. So uh, yeah, came back again anyway, at least we've got this footage and see what's going on. It doesn't look like it now, but uh, there's actually a lot more people down here than in Soy 6, and uh, things really can get crazy down this Soy, I tell you that. And uh, you gotta see there's uh, some crazy people doing some crazy stuff. Yeah, there's just something about Soy 7, I don't know what it is, but the closer it gets to the sun going down, the more mental they get. <laughs> it's like uh, an insano meter. Uh, the closer the darker, the more insane it all becomes. I shot this footage about 5 o'clock in the afternoon, and uh, things are really starting to pick up. Uh, unfortunately, I took off a little bit early. Should have hung around a bit longer, and uh, because things were really starting to flip out, you know. <laughs> it's uh, tomorrow. I'll be hanging around longer for sure. Well, I have more footage as it gets uh, later in the evening. I'll show you exactly what I'm talking about. Those of you who are down there, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> you know what it's like. So uh, yeah, I'll be. Uh, I'll be down there longer tomorrow, for sure. Soy 7. So these are the last shots I got going up Soy 8 uh, before my 
battery ran out. Uh, yeah, we took off after this and went and got some of Patty's best kebabs over on my dad's side. Scoff there on them to see. <laughs> but uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed this video, guys. I'll be making another one tomorrow. I'll be uh, hanging around for the long run tomorrow. I'll get some of that crazy action I've been telling you about that I failed to deliver. And uh, yeah, if you uh, leave a comment, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and all that stuff. <laughs> so, uh, Happy Songcrown guys, 2017. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.